Welcome to my passion travel channel and I invite you I make content on tourism and subscribe to my channel and put a little like. Souvlaki, souvlaki is one of the most iconic Greek street foods. It consists of small pieces of marinated meat, commonly pork, chicken, or lamb, skewered and grilled to perfection. The grilled meat is often served wrapped in warm pita bread and garnished with tomatoes, onions, tzatziki sauce, a yogurt-based sauce with cucumbers and garlic, and sometimes fries. Souvlaki is a classic and beloved Greek street food that has gained popularity worldwide. It is a delicious grilled meat skewer that is typically made with pork, chicken, or lamb. Souvlaki is known for its flavorful and tender meat, as well as its accompanying toppings and sauces. Here's more information about souvlaki meat preparation. Souvlaki starts with small pieces of marinated meat, commonly pork, chicken, or lamb. The meat is typically marinated in a mixture of olive oil, lemon juice, garlic, oregano, and other herbs and spices. This marinade helps to tenderize the meat and infuse it with flavor, skewering, and grilling. After marinating, the meat is skewered onto metal or wooden skewers and then grilled over an open flame or on a charcoal grill. The skewers are often rotated during grilling to ensure even cooking and to achieve a nice charred exterior while keeping the meat juicy and succulent. Serving, once the meat is grilled to perfection, it is commonly served as a street food in a few different ways. Pita souvlaki, the grilled meat is removed from the skewers and placed into warm pita bread. It is typically accompanied by a variety of toppings such as sliced tomatoes, onions, and sometimes fries. Satsiki sauce, a yogurt-based sauce with cucumbers and garlic, is a popular condiment that is often drizzled over the meat and toppings, souvlaki skewers. In some instances, the skewered meat is served on its own, allowing you to enjoy the juicy meat straight from the skewers. It is common to dip the meat into sauces like tzatziki or squeeze fresh lemon juice over it for added flavor. Side dishes, souvlaki is often accompanied by traditional Greek side dishes such as Greek salad, horiatiki, which consists of tomatoes, cucumbers, onions, olives, and feta cheese dressed with olive oil and herbs. Other common side dishes include roasted potatoes, grilled vegetables, or rice pilaf. Gyro, similar to souvlaki, gyro is a popular Greek street food that features thinly sliced meat, typically pork, chicken, or beef, cooked on a vertical rotisserie. The tender meat is then wrapped in a pita bread along with fresh vegetables, tzatziki sauce, and other condiments. Gyro is another popular Greek street food that has gained worldwide recognition and is loved for its delicious flavors and satisfying taste. It is similar to souvlaki but with some slight differences. Here's more information about gyro meat preparation. Gyro is traditionally made with seasoned and marinated meat, commonly pork, chicken, or a combination of both. The meat is typically seasoned with a blend of spices, including garlic, oregano, paprika, and sometimes cinnamon. The marinade helps to infuse the meat with flavor and ensure tenderness. Cooking process. The marinated meat is stacked onto a vertical rotisserie called a gyro spit. As the spit rotates, the meat slowly cooks and roasts allowing the outer layers to become crispy and flavorful while keeping the inside juicy and tender. The rotisserie method helps to ensure even cooking and the development of delicious charred edges, slicing and assembly. Once the meat is cooked, it is thinly sliced off the rotisserie using a sharp knife. The sliced meat is typically served in warm pita bread or flatbread. It is often accompanied by various toppings and condiments such as sliced tomatoes, onions, lettuce, and a generous amount of tzatziki sauce, which is a yogurt-based sauce with cucumbers, garlic, and herbs. 
Some variations of gyro may also include French fries inside the wrap variations, while the classic gyro is made with pork or chicken. Lamb gyro is also a popular variation. Lamb gyro typically has a richer and slightly gamier flavor compared to pork or chicken. In some regions, you may also find vegetarian or vegan versions of gyro using ingredients like falafel, grilled vegetables, or plant-based meat alternatives. Spanakopita Spanakopita is a savory pastry filled with spinach, feta cheese, onions, and herbs. The filling is wrapped in layers of flaky phyllo dough and baked until golden and crispy. It is often served as a handheld snack or appetizer. Spanakopita is a delicious Greek pastry that is widely enjoyed as a street food and appetizer. It is a savory pie made with layers of flaky phyllo dough filled with a mixture of spinach, feta cheese, onions, herbs, and spices. Spanakopita is known for its delightful combination of crispy, golden pastry and flavorful, cheesy filling. Here's more information about Spanakopita filling preparation. The filling for Spanakopita is typically made by sautéing spinach and onions until they are soft and wilted. The cooked spinach is then combined with crumbled feta cheese, herbs such as dill and parsley, and seasonings like salt, pepper, and sometimes nutmeg. The mixture is well combined to create a flavorful filling. Phyllo dough and layering. Phyllo dough, which is thin and delicate, is an essential component of spanakopita. The dough is layered with melted butter or olive oil to create a crispy and flaky texture. Each layer of phyllo dough is brushed with oil or butter before adding the next layer. The number of layers can vary, but usually, a sufficient amount is used to provide a nice balance between the filling and pastry, assembly, and baking. The spinach and feta filling is spread evenly over the layered phyllo dough, and the pastry is folded or rolled to enclose the filling. The spanakopita can be prepared in various shapes, including triangular parcels, rectangular sheets, or even as a pie. Before baking, the top of the spanakopita is often brushed with more oil or butter to ensure a golden, crispy crust. Cooking process. Spanakopita is typically baked in the oven until the phyllo dough turns golden brown and crisp, and the filling is heated through. The baking time may vary depending on the size and thickness of the spanakopita.